Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking. Today what I'm going to show you is one of my favorite recipes, so let's get started. Welcome to Cheryl's Home Cooking, and today what I'm going to show you is my homemade apple butter. It's really good, so let's get started. In the pot on top of my stove, I cored and peeled three pounds of Granny Smith apples, and I cut them into wedges. Place them in my saucepan. Then I'll add three-fourths of a cup of apple cider, a half a teaspoon of salt, and one cup of water. So in goes the three-fourths cup of apple cider vinegar. A half a teaspoon of salt. One cup of water. I'll put my burner on medium high. You want to simmer for about 25 to 30 minutes, stirring occasionally. Turn off your burner when the apples are nice and tender and most of the liquid is gone. Now I'll turn my burner on to low. The apples are getting a little bit tender. And like I said, just let this simmer for about 25 to 30 minutes and until mostly all the liquid is gone. I'll put my lid on. Now I'll check on my apples. I'll take, remove my lid. The apples are nice and tender and most of the liquid is absorbed, so now I'll place it in my blender. To the apples in my blender, I'll add in one cup of packed brown sugar, a tablespoon of apple pie spice, a teaspoon of vanilla extract. I'll put my lid on. And then puree them. I'll take my lid off. Oh yeah, looks good. Now I'll put all this back in the same pot. I have my burner on low. And then you'll stir this every couple minutes or until it thickens and turns a dark brown, about 15 minutes. I'll remove my lid. You can see the apple butter now turned a nice dark brown. Smells good. So I'll put my lid back on, turn my burner off, and let it cool. Now that I let the apple butter cool, I placed it in this jar and I have the sign saying apple butter 2018 and those three pounds of Granny Smith apples made this quart so now I have homemade apple butter it was so simple and easy to make too this apple butter you can store in your refrigerator for about three weeks can't wait to give it a try well, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking and watch me make my homemade apple butter. I'll see you guys next video. Enjoy. Well, thanks so much for tuning in to another episode of Cheryl's Home Cooking. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next video. Bye-bye.